Mackenzie Dern versus Yan Xiaonan. That was a grueling, tough fight for both ladies. They were going after it. Nothing but stand up grappling, jujitsu, wrestling. It was just, they were tired. They left everything out, emptied the gas tank, no energy left, and absolutely fun fight. That was a fun fight. They were going after it, both of them. Now, I had it the same, majority decision. Nah, I had it three rounds to two for Yan Shaonan. First, first round, Yan was doing the stand-up jabs, powerful hooks and straights, and just won the fight on significant straights. But then the second round started. Mackenzie Dern just wanted to get the takedown. She worked hard for it. She got it. She spent... A majority of the round on top and trying to get submissions and stuff, but just couldn't do it because Yan had, I don't know what she learned, but she learned some defense, jujitsu, grappling, takedown wise, and yeah. Third round and fourth round, it was all Yan shall not. She was on the outside, landing some slick strikes, stuffed all the takedowns from McKinsey Dern, and just flat out dominated those rounds. The fifth round, I thought it was going to be the same because Mackenzie Dern was kind of tired. But no, something in the corner between fourth and fifth rounds for Mackenzie Dern, hit her corner told her that she's losing the fight and that she has to go for it. She has to go for the win, either knock her out or submit her. So as soon as the fifth round started, she just came out guns blazing, just combo after combo. And then she got the takedown. And for the most of the like four minutes straight in the fifth round, Mackenzie Dern was on top trying to finish off Yan Shaonan. She couldn't do it. She was, she came close. She came extremely close to finishing the fight, but no, she couldn't do it. Yan Shaonan got the dub, three rounds to two. Very close, grueling fight. They were throwing combos after combos, grappling, wrestling, jujitsu transitions. It was just a fun, but tough, grueling fight for both ladies. And yeah, fun fight, fun night. And can't wait to see both of them again fight inside the ring. Mackenzie Dern striking has improved, but not to a level of a championship caliber level yet. But her wrestling, takedowns, everything, jiu-jitsu especially is... Barn on one of the best in that division. But if you can't take them out down, it starts in the stand up, and that's where Yan Shaonan shone shine through, and that's how she won the fight. It always starts on the feet. And if you don't got that, then you lose a close fight such as this one. Mackenzie Dern just has she needs time. She needs time. Maybe one or two more years of Straight Muay Thai, kickboxing, boxing, just striking. If she focuses on striking and she develops that side of her game, she's going to be a champion in that division sometime in the future. But time is a factor. She is getting old and she might, you know, get too old to contend for the championship. As for Yan Shaonan, I think she's ready for another i don't think did she fight for the championship i don't know if she was she did but yeah anyway yan shaonan is not quite a caliber championship caliber fighter as well because uh her striking's good but not on the par of who's in that division rose jacek you know shevchenko she's not on that level yet as for her takedown defense, was very good, but she needs to work on her jujitsu because every time she she was in full guard, like she was on full guard on top of Mackenzie Dern, but Mackenzie Dern almost in all of them kind of transitioned or sweeped her to Mackenzie Dern to get on top of Xiaonan, and yeah, that's yeah, that's how the whole fight went. So Yan Xiaonan has to work on her defense. Jiu-Jitsu or grappling wrestling defense. And as for Mackenzie Dern, 
just straight striking. She should she should definitely work on striking, and then she'll both of them will be good. That's it for night at the UFC uh, fight night. I am so tired. I'm gonna go to bed right now, and I'll see y'all tomorrow morning or afternoon. Or yeah, just check out my other channel for vlogs and stuff. Good night. Love y'all and take care of yourself.